Hello everyone, it's Lily from Daily Journals. Welcome back to my channel and to another video. Um, vlogs aren't going to be quite back on the um, channel just yet, but I am going to film today a day in the life. Um, I don't know whether you can hear it in my voice. You might if you're used to my voice, but I am full of cold. Um, yeah, so I'm sorry that I'm going to be sniffy and that my voice is like this for the day. Um, but it's Thursday, the 19th of January. Um, and... I'm off work today, it's my only day off work this week. I've been doing normal days Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and I'm on evening shifts, so 2 p.m. till half 11 um, the rest of the week. So, I've, it's quite, like, it's already like 10 a.m., so I've, I had a bit of a lazy morning. I didn't get up as soon as my alarm went off. I had a bit of a lying and a bit of rest, and then I've done my morning routine, and I've just gone to make the list of things I need to do today, because I'm very behind on everything, and gone, oh, because I'm not doing new releases this week, month um I don't have a video for this video so what can I do and I've gone I can't think of anything else so I'm just going to do a late day in the life vlog so that's why you got this <laughs> um so I make my to-do list at the moment on google um keep which is a notes app I haven't actually filmed tomorrow's video so that is number one job but then after that I essentially sort my google keep and I will show the whole thing on I'll put my ipad screen on now um of recording like reorganizing it but essentially reorganize it into things I can do now and things that need something else to already be done um and then I split the things I can do now into bits of sections of five so I can random number gen generate what I do it's not necessarily the most efficient way to do things because it's much more efficient to like bulk do tasks but at the moment that's what I need to do so yeah so first I'm gonna go and film my February lineup um because that's coming out tomorrow and isn't filmed yet oh. um and then yeah I'll use a random number generator to decide what to do next yeah I'm putting a camera down what's that shall we give you some foodies Good girls. You like salmon today? You don't always. Oh, it's as good as it looks. That's mm. why. Well, that was the most hot mess, um, pre-planned me I've ever filmed. Uh, no, kit lineup I've ever filmed. I need to get these back in my folder. So I just thought I'd chat with you while I'm doing that. So, um, yeah, my my video is filmed, but it is a bit of a hot mess. But oh well. Um, it's going up tomorrow, it's fine. I probably could have refilmed it and made it better, but um, my beautiful editing diaries all let sort it out for me because they are superstars. Um, so, yeah, I'm just popping these back in here. Um, oh, I've got proper aching from this fluey cold thing I have. It's not enjoyable at all. So what I do is I put my pre-plan with me foil like that and my memory plan with me foil backwards. Don't know why, that's just what I do. Um, it's what I've done for a while how I function with this um, so at some point I really need to make the functionals for this because um, otherwise it's not going to happen but I'm so behind on other stuff like it's not a priority right now um, so yeah that's there it's my kit folder obviously there's still quite a lot in the second half of the year um, and the first half of the year because I'm not very up to date but this will become smaller soon hate how chunky it is at the moment but it's fine so that's that um i'm playing a stupid phone call game called avenger but it's proper addictive um and there's an event going on but i'm trying to get like the best gear before going into the event so i'm just i'm gonna wait because it's obviously on for three days it won't take me very long um it's also it's on till sunday so i'll do it on sunday morning if i haven't um made it too complete before then um there are no forced ads in the game, but like watching ads is helpful. Um, anyway, <laughs> this is not what this is meant to be about, but I freaking love this game. I'm basically done with that level, but it's fine. Um, right, for now, so we're going to tick February lineup. I'm going to get rid of that empty row. Why do I have an email? Okay, so we now have our list. This is the list I was talking about before. So we have 5, 10, 15, 18 things that can be done straight away. And then this is like the stuff that will replace other stuff. So we go, hey, Google. Random number one to 18. Here's a random number, one. So that is prepping for my pre-plan with me. Honestly, 
I kind of don't want to do that now and I'm tempted to, to take that off the list for now because until I know how much I get done today I can't really plan out next week because it kind of depends how much I get done today so I'm gonna be naughty and move that back down there and then we just have to move one thing up from each section to um replace so we're gonna go hey google random number one to 17. four so that is actually making memory notes so i'm like a week behind on my memory notes so i'm gonna go sit on my ipad and do that here's a random number nine and then because it said that afterwards we might tidy the house afterwards we'll see and um, we'll see how i feel after my memory notes but for now i'm gonna go and sit my ipad in the living room and make some memory notes preferably with social because it's for um the week of it's like the first week of the year the second to the eighth of the year um so i would quite like so to be with me to make the memory notes because otherwise i'm not gonna remember um but yeah that's what i'm gonna go and do now tuesday the third of january i was off work again oh, i started yoga this day so i did that at some point i feel like i did it quite late probably there is that when my phone was starting to die our conversation was any idea what we did in the evening I suspect we binged Jane and possibly an episode of Game of Thrones, but I don't think we did because you were feeling okay. you wanted something a bit more like ours. Wednesday the 4th of January, my car was in the shop and we travelled together. I read a bit whilst waiting for you to finish work. I, I don't know if we actually let it cool down and then right at the end of the night I whipped the cream up and spread it on top and we had a slice. We were understaffed. Oh, I didn't put yoga in this day either. You know, that'd be what you thought that I was like, I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've got no idea. Probably eat lazy eating. Wait, I was doing revision every day at this point as well, wasn't I? When did yeah. I start doing daily revision before this? Because I realised how soon my yoga was. Any ideas on Saturday the 7th of January? No. Yay, we're up to date with memory notes. Yay. So I'm sitting in the same position. Um, essentially, Google, my random number generator told me I need to bring, well, it told me that I should brainstorm my stall for Palantines. I don't even know how to go about this. <laughs> That's kind of where I'm at. So, because waste not want not, I'm gonna pull one of the un completely unused notes pages out the back of my old planner, because they're not gonna get used now. Um, and there's no point in loads of paper just sitting there being useless and it's in reach so that's why basically um then i'm gonna grab a pen some variety there's no decent pens that i want to that it's not very helpful uh, so just I need to think about it so things I want so the things I want to like show off the most are obviously planners and inserts but I can't take that much so I think I'm only going to take undated ones because then if they don't sell it doesn't matter um so we'll see so planners and inserts is something I want to show off and the twinkle bundles are the like two things I want to like show off show off um and then i'm also going to have like a make your own oops bag section um the thing is i basically i want to make my stall not like just flat and boring and i want to make it look interesting which is the difficulty um <laughs> which is why i'm trying to brainstorm it now so if I, if I need to buy anything for it it's i can buy it and get it in time um and then i will have oops bags and then I want to try and have some of the fonts showing. Because um, I just, last time what I did is I had like the mid sticker albums and you could flick through the sheets and then get them out. But I just don't think it worked very well. <sighs> but then I don't really have a better way of doing it. So maybe I will still do that. I don't know though. Do you think it works? Having everything in sticker albums. Having the things in sticker albums for people to look through. So I don't really think it did. 
I think having them in boxes like that might be better. That's how they, so they were like that. Mm -hmm. But they were also, I want to buy more of these. Uh -huh. And then have like the samples. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah how that, it was. that worked quite well actually. That's how it was. Unless you. Uh, you've got so many of them. What were you thinking? Um, and have them on like a poster board. I did wonder about that. I wonder about having, so it's a six foot table, I think. Let me just check. The... I, I do wonder about having a poster board at the back, if we can get one. Mm -hmm. That's like freestanding to show off the fonts mm. in some way. Yeah. I've also got all the washi as well. Oh yeah, lots of washi. This is why I need more space. And then have the boxes of stickers in front of that. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah. I don't think we're going to have room for the folders of stickers, to be honest. Um, it, looks, it sounds like you're not going to have a lot of spare space, are you? No. And then some space for planners here, both as inserts or as... We'll see. Some sort of acrylic stand here with height. Mm -hmm. to have um and then you can keep it if i've only got one table you can keep the main stock of washi at the back and then when someone asks for a specific one i can get out the yeah yeah cool so i have a i have a plan in it like I, we could probably do with setting up a six foot table and testing it in fact is our table six foot probably is yeah i think it is okay so i have my stall kind of vaguely planned out and I've worked out what I'm doing roughly um, and I bought a load of stuff including loads more of the A6 dividers I use for my personal sticker storage to use for the shop sticker storage because I think it will just make it way more easy for people to read and to get things um, so I need to make all of those at some point but that is a future me problem. Um, for now um, I think I'm gonna go and film one of next week's videos because um, I would really like to get like well, all of next week's videos filmed, so two memory plan with me is definitely filmed today. So I'm gonna think I'm gonna go and film the first one of those. These are these two are my um last two honeymoon plan with me's, so they're gonna be long ones. Um so I'm gonna go and get on with the first one. So she's just gone for a run and then when he gets back we'll have some lunch, which to be honest will probably be noodles, and we'll probably watch an episode of Jane the Virgin while we have some lunch. Um so that's kind of the plan for the next couple of hours. Um let's see how we get. Uh, but I've got all my stickers pulled out and I've actually gone through and like properly pre-planned I don't I'm really worried about running out of stickers to be honest in the next couple of spreads and um, but I've like full-on gone through and pre-planned what like my day extenders and stuff because there's gonna need to be so many anyway pop back in later hey so it's actually now Friday um I filmed those two videos, uh, well no, I filmed the video um, and then I was like, oh I'll film the other one, but it took me, both of them took me absolutely forever, like they were my two last honeymoon spreads and they were so long, um, so they took absolutely forever, um, but I got them done, well no, I got one and a half done, then we had um, dinner, we had a like Chinese takeaway but at home thing, um, it was from Gusto, it was like a Chinese feast it was called. Um, now then um we had date night and we played stardew valley and um, i'm taking a real effort to make sure me and so keep spending time together just chilling and having fun so yeah we started playing stardew valley for our date night which was a lot of fun <laughs> but i didn't get any footage of it then we went to bed and i finished um reading my current book which was one of the novellas by ali hazelwood um stuck with you and i actually enjoyed it more it's actually the least well rated of them but i'm with ali hazelwood's books i like the less well rated ones better um Oh, I also did yoga between dinner and our date night. Um, so yeah, and then this morning I got up and I finished that plan with me. It's now like 11.30. I start work at two, so I'm gonna go leave for work at one. Um, but I thought I'd just finish off at this plan with this with that. Um, so I'm about to do my yoga, which I'll film, and then it'll probably be some lunch episode of Jane and I might pull some stickers or something like that um, whilst we do that and have some chill time with Soch or we might play Stardew, don't know, we'll see. Um, but yeah, 
that's the plan for the rest of the day and I'll just vlog that and then that will be it for this video. But anyway, I'm gonna film me doing my yoga now. So, um, just got showered and dressed quickly and about to have some lunch and watch a bit of Jane. We'll see how we feel after I've eaten my lunch as to what we do for the last 20, 30 minutes before I go to work. Um, but yeah. Okay, so it's actually the next morning, it's Saturday morning. I'm back at work at um, two again today. I need a break from work, I'm so behind. Like, I'm not behind behind, but I'm like behind where I wanted to be at this point in the year um, by a lot. <laughs> but anyway, um, so I just, I need to catch up at some point, but I don't know when it's gonna be. There's just so much on at the moment and life doesn't seem to be giving me a break. Um, but anyway, that is it for this video. Comment like down below if you enjoyed it. Let me know what you think of these shorter vlogs and I'll try and bring some more in if you like them. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.